in the normal muffler. That's uh, all they do with the straight pipe. So we're gonna stick this son of a bitch in fucking, uh, probably in, I don't know what that is there, B, probably B1. Now we got this big fucking thing behind it. We're gonna just step it out of the way. Hey guys, how's she going today? How are you today, P? Well, we're finally back combining after uh, two days off here because of uh, fog in the morning. Almost as heavy of wetness as if it rained. Can you go in there and move the throttle? Yeah. Hot in there? Okay, move the throttle. Think you can do it? See the little lever with the black knob? No, little lever. <laughs> I don't even know you don't even know, eh? That one. Oh. Oh. Okay, you put our stuff in there, our lunch kit. So, Amanda has just started. Well, we've done a sample first here to make sure it was dry. <laughs> it's, uh, hell is the time, 10 to 3. And they are testing 13.2. Push our magic little button in. Holds the uh, fuel rack open. Make it start easier. Same thing as what the John Deere's do, but they do it on their own there with that vacuum aneroid. Okay, hop out of the way. This way. The more in you go, the more in the way you are. Did you know that? No. Oh, well now you do. <laughs> I don't want to stay on it though. Way too much. Nice! Starts good, eh? Now what? Now we gotta make your little bed again. So... Sophia wants to come in the Massey. We got to make her little bed. We got about uh, 30 acres of soybeans left. Won't take very long here, a couple, three hours. My shoes off. Want me to get out of your way so you can get up there? Yeah. <laughs> And we'll be done. So we have uh, this little hill where she's working. And then that back 
piece there and then a little piece there and then we got a couple of spots around sloughs that we had left because it was a little bit green so clean that up and we'll be done now uh, we won't need the three trucks it'd be fucking awesome if we did but we won't you're comfy yeah. <laughs> all righty let's get at her Right full. Hey Pete. Yeah. <laughs> We're not full because we've been cleaning up little shit spots all over the place around the sloughs that we had left. So taking us a bit longer to make a hopper, but I can see the piles, so anyway, Amanda's right loaded, so that's nice. You having fun? Yeah. What? Yeah. Good. <laughs> beans so uh, we went and did a sample and tested it and it was 12.7 I believe so dry so Nick and I had 30 acres left from the other day that we never got done so that's what we're working on we have all the trucks just parked right there So yeah, we'll finish these uh, 30 acres and that'll be the wrap of Harvest 2022. We were spreading shit this morning, got almost all the corrals cleaned out. Um, what else? I think that's it for now anyways. So we'll continue on till we're finished.
clip of the old Massey there before uh, Harvest 2022 is over. Nick's baby. Anyways, we got one little triangle piece left and we're done. Well, we're getting down to the end of it here and all. <laughs> Maybe another five acres, if that kind of thing, so. Damn near full. Amanda made another rink full hopper here a few minutes ago, so you can see it. Her, uh, I think it's over her window there again, so. Now at 35 feet versus 22 there, she fills up a little bit faster than we do, so. <laughs> oh well. All right, we're gonna bring you back again for a minute, so we'll talk to you again here in a few. Well, just went around real quick here and picked up all the uh, little green spots we had left here when we first started combining. And Amanda's just picking up the last swipe there, so. And that'll be it for this year. brought home already but now we're uh, in the 895 here grandpa henry's been working on heavy harrowing here on and off for the last uh, few days so uh, we're just gonna get started here and try and get a chunk of it done uh, before he gets out here anyways and then uh, We'll be ready to move to the uh, stuff over at his place. There is about, well, there's a quarter and a half here left. Uh, he's got the canola stubble all done, and I had started on the barley here a few days ago. But uh, I don't know, I'd like to try to harrow the pea stubble, but I don't know what kind of job it's going to do. So 
we'll see what happens with that anyways, but anyway, let this thing power up and let the old girl warm up a little bit. I think that's where we're gonna leave you for this video, so hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you hit that like button and comment, subscribe for more, all that good stuff. Other than that, thanks for watching. I'll talk to all you in the next one.